I graduated and got a degree in painting. All my background was in the visual art. It had nothing to do with photography. I started shooting black and white. And then at some point I looked at the image that I had photographed, which was an American flag near a chartreuse tree with a gray house. And the picture had nothing to do with what I was interested in. And I realized that I was drawn not to shades of gray, but I was drawn to color. People often ask, how can they be a better photographer? And what it really comes out to is to be a more interesting person. I didn't print anything for a number of years. And then somebody showed me Epson prints. And I was amazed at them. I was just I was blown away because there was quality, and, and I've always been a fan of exactitude. And these were sharp, beautiful prints. The things I was seeing were so perfect. I just could not conceive of the fact that I could get a digital image that wasn't on photographic paper and it would be better than what I'd had before. Printing in-house was a joy because it begins to help me realize my vision. And I find that with the 9900 printer, I know what I want, I know what moves me. And I'm able to get colors on this hot pressed bright paper using a 9900 printer, I haven't been able to get before. Now I seem to be able to get the blacks I want, the oranges, the green, the prints, the things that you can take out of a dark room, the things that you can look at in any circumstances, the thing that you can show people day or night, and you don't have to put them in a machine, you don't have to put a projector up or anything like that. Those are the things that you can build your reputation on. Those are the things that you can exhibit. And it is, in and of itself, a beautiful object. I bought this building in 1966. I bought it in a bad neighborhood, but it had light and air, and a view and space, and it's a six-story building, and three of those stories are devoted to showing pictures. And the pictures bring life to the place. I got 13,000 square feet of print. And because of the Epson printer, I'm making so many beautiful prints that I'm running out of space.